Tonight, three dozen volunteers serve dinner, dessert, and some holiday cheer to hundreds struggling to find and keep a safe place to live. They met in a dining hall at Camilla's house, a well-known provider of care for homeless guests. But this heaping helping of kindness stunned people starved for a reason to smile. CBS News Miami's Larry Seward explains. Yes, my friend. Their smiles may seem easy, but Robin Woodstock and Cheryl Glover live on the edge. Because I don't have no family but my son. I love my family and the past I want to give up. Never did Woodstock think she'd find help at Camilla's house, a ministry offering shelter, food, and care to people struggling with homelessness. More than a thousand in Miami-Dade County have no permanent shelter. The, the violence in the streets. This crime in the street because no heavy love. Tony Pedro started cooking and serving food downtown with his wife and kids every Thursday to spread comfort. Then every December, they organized dinner parties. 26 years later, three dozen people, volunteers from St. Augustine and Lady of the Lakes Catholic Churches, members of the County Homeless Trust, and others joined. I was previously married to his daughter, and I just started doing it through them, and I've been doing it since. With more help, service grew, more decorations, piles of food, and heaps of life changing motivation. Motivation on both sides of the buffet. Jim Sullivan started serving decades ago. I was, you know, going through some issues, and, and I've always found that the best way to deal with those is, you know, look, try and help somebody else out. Feeding more than 400 hardly feels enough for Pedro. You can't stop the mission on yourself. You can't. Tony loves the way this party's grown over the years with more volunteers, and this time, backpacks full of gifts for everyone they serve. Teresha Moore scored clothes, gloves, and toiletries. Everybody that was a part of this, thank you so much. Ho, ho, ho! Woodstock and Glover enjoyed gifts too, but both savor the bonds built with strangers who feel like much more. I got a new family, but I never knew they were here all them years, and they brightened up my life. In Overtown, Larry Seward, CBS News, Miami.